Bonjour. Bonjour. Je m'appelle Kevin. That's all I know. I took French two years in high school, two years in college. That's all I know. Here's the funny thing. My wife is Panamanian, so she's, uh, she's fluent in English and Spanish. So sometimes when we have sex, she'll just go into Spanish whenever she wants. I don't know any Spanish. So I'll go into the French I know. I'm like, uh, bonjour. <laughs> Guy la fleur. <laughs> Cirque du Soleil. <laughs> so I am one of 10 kids. That's too many kids, first of all. Who, anyone else from a big family? 10 kids in our family. We just take showers together. You ever take a shower with your brother growing up? I've had girlfriends like, let's take a shower together. It's Valentine's Day. I'm like, I'm not going in there unless my brothers are here. <laughs> Plus, kids are so spoiled now, seriously. I'm gonna raise my kids Latino, seriously. Because I see, I see white women, God bless you. I see white women at the mall trying to be good parents. Like, Jason, I'm gonna count to 10, then you're gonna get it. Hour later, she's like, 134. <laughs> Lad women, black women, like one, bam! <laughs> Surprise attack works every time. Plus, you know what else? Kids love surprises. <laughs> That's in all the baby books. <laughs> Plus, kids today, they're, they're such punks with all the, like, I live in New York City, all the kids with the hip hop. They got Tourette's from all the hip hop they listen to. My wife, we went to see 50 Cent, she's into the hip hop. 50 Cent's hardcore, he's like, white people suck. And we're like, yeah, we suck. <laughs> Put your hands in the air, they stole my wallet. To scam that hands in there. I put them up one at a time now. <laughs> I, I no longer act as if I just don't care. I care a lot. <laughs> I care a lot. They're stealing my shit. <laughs> Every rapper has the same move. You ever notice that? That's the latino being extra serious. That's the part of songs you really pay attention to. It works. I use it myself. I'm like, put some butter on that bagel, bitch. She gets it right, she knows I'm not messing around. <laughs> Plus, my wife's Latina, so she's all jealous all the time. We women are jealous, I don't know, once you, once you have kids, do women just get crazy jealous? My wife thinks, because she wants to have sex with me, everyone does. I'm like, honey, if that was the case, I would not have married you. <laughs> Why would I marry her if everybody wanted to have sex with me? Wouldn't that be rude to everyone? <laughs> it really would, Montreal. Then we got into a fight at dinner. She wanted how many women I had sex with before we got married. I'm like, how many women after? That's what you should focus on. <laughs> Let her know. Let her know. Well, I love my wife, though, and everything. But it is hard, right? It's hard to be married. You guys all married and everything? No, because before I got married, I watched like, a, a people, on t like people on TV like killing their spouse. Like, why would you kill your spouse? They're gonna figure out it's you. Why don't you just get divorced? But now I'm like, now I get it. <laughs> now I get it. It's not enough to just get divorced. You wanna send a message. <laughs> Plus when you're married, sometimes it hits you like, wow, we're together, right? Doesn't it just hit you like, wow, we're together forever? I think it hit my wife the other day. We're just sitting around. She goes, why are you acting so weird now? I'm like, I'm not acting weird now. This is the real me. When we were dating, I was being nice and buying you stuff all the time. Then I was acting weird. This is the real me. You don't like it. Nobody likes it. That's why I was single when you met me. You got punked, bitch. <laughs> Thank you very much. You guys are fantastic. Especially when it comes to investigating crimes. You know, in a big city, crime can go unsolved for like 20 or 30 years. In a small town, the police are there. Can you describe the man who robbed you? Yeah, he was Dwayne. Imagine if, uh, if a smaller creature jumped on your back <laughs> and was like, take me over there. You'd be like, get the hell off. You'd probably kill it. You'd probably kill it and eat it. <laughs>